This is a demonstration video of the Ultra Record Player. I'm just going to show you how to use it so that you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. When you receive it, the first thing to do is to screw down the two transit screws of the deck located here and here. You screw those all the way down fully clockwise so the deck floats on its springs. The four main controls are on the right hand side for on off, volume, bass and treble. On the deck, speed control on the left, start stop on the right and record size detection is automatic. You can load between one and six records, I'll demonstrate with two, just so you can see it play. Put the records onto the spindle edge and put the stacker arm across, select the correct speed and Click the right hand control all the way around to start the auto changer. There were so many things that I wanted to say to you. If you want to skip to the next record, click the right hand control knob all the way around again. So I'll just demonstrate now with the start of a 12 inch record too. When you stack a 10 or 12 inch record, the black horizontal lever here is the size detection system. So you need to make sure the record is stacked above the black lever like so. And that is so that the tone arm knows to land in the correct position. lifts off automatically when it reaches the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and you just want to play one record manually at a time, you can just pop an individual record down the spindle onto the platter and select the manual option so that the turntable starts to turn and you can then place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing, carefully load the stacker arm down so it knows to switch off automatically at the end of the record. If you leave it playing with the stacker bar left in the upright position like so, that triggers the repeat function which is for 7 inch records only and it will replay the same 7 inch over again until manually switched off. So I hope that covers everything for you. If you do have any questions when you receive it, I'll include my personal email address in with the machine. Please use that method to contact me.